So, first of all, good morning. Second, I just cannot get back into eating breakfast. I was eating scrambled eggs for breakfast every day for like two months and then we ran out of eggs. I went on a work trip and I just could never get back on schedule. But the point of me telling you that is don't judge my breakfast. I'm gonna have some sea salt and pepper popcorn, but it's so good. And you can't always find that flavor, so if you find it, you gotta grab it. And second of all, I opened the fridge to get my daily kickstart, and I saw the fridge full of black cherry, which, as you know if you watch our vlogs, is my favorite. And it's so hard to find them sometimes, so we go to two different Publix. We're about midway between two. And we alternate so that we can always try to have black cherry kickstarts because it's the flavor that all three of us agree with. And when we moved here, we were not seeing them very often. So we talked to a manager, I should say Linda talked to a manager, and he said he would order extra. Well, it, we got to a point where we weren't seeing any anymore. So Linda mentioned something to a employee and she was like, oh, he doesn't work here anymore. So it's been a struggle. But I opened the fridge this morning to see our little kickstart shelf is full of black cherry, which is the best feeling ever. Do you guys like kickstarts? Put in the comments below. Look what Duncan made. It's like having my own personal chef. Right? It's true. It's true. Is it delicious? I don't know, I haven't tried it yet. Oh. Gadget wants to try. Gadget wants to try. She's licking her lips. I don't know what she thinks is happening. Gadget, what did you find? These dogs are impatiently waiting for their D I N N E R. It's still 40 minutes before we normally feed them. They are jumping and getting excited every time I move, right? But they don't know that I have a phone call at the time I normally feed them, so they're going to have to wait a little bit. I'm sorry. She's like not even like really sitting because she knows she's going to, well, she thinks and hopes that she's going to eat soon. You guys are gonna have to wait. You're just gonna have to wait a little bit. Am I getting head tilts from Gadget? That's not normal. Gizmo's usually the one that head tilts. Oh. Somebody's hungry. Oh, don't be sassy. In like an hour, okay? She says, no, now. <laughs> Gadget, you gotta wait an hour, okay? Hey guys, so I've been done with work for about an hour and a half, and tonight is Operation Ketchup. So obviously you know, you've seen, if you've been watching the last couple days, I have an insane pile of laundry, but I'm not even planning on touching that tonight. I mean, unless I magically get everything done, but we'll see. Um, I started this plan last week where I was going to work on my week, my next week's content for my LuLaRoe page ahead of time, like one at, one day at a time. So I never had like a large chunk of time I was consuming my day with, but last week just got away from me and it just didn't happen. So I still have yet to do this week's content this week, if that makes sense. So Tomorrow's content is not all the way done, so I need to do that, and then I'm hoping to knock out Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, so that starting tomorrow I can be ahead again. But here's hoping that I can stay focused, because so far it's not happening. And I think part of it is that I'm, I'm like hungry, and I'm thirsty, and I just really want to focus. And I have water that I've been trying to drink, and for whatever reason, that's just not cutting it for me. So 
If you watched my review of the strawberry guava diet coke, you know I'm not a fan, but I just really wanted something fruity and um, I didn't even have lemon or lime to put in my water to make it better, so diet coke it is. And uh, send me all your productive thoughts and we'll see how, I'll check in after I'm done or when it gets to the point where I need to pass out because I'm tired, but here we go. Hey guys, sorry the lighting is so bad. I'm in a parking lot on International Drive, but I'm coming to visit a friend and I'm over by the Orlando Eye and the swings and I just have to show you this. Why are they doing that in the rain? I actually don't know if there's anyone on there. Usually they're screaming. So I'm home. No so decided he's gonna keep a close watch on me because I did not finish my work. Um, well, my LuLaRoe work and I um, opted to go visit a friend and said, hello, bud. But here's the deal. So I have two screens for my day job and my laptop's on a dock. And for whatever reason, my... <laughs> My dock isn't charging my laptop, so I was like working and it just died on me. So I plugged it in with the plug and came back, tried again, and it's still not charging it. So I'm just gonna work because at least now it's charged and I can have both screens. It just makes it so much easier. I know first world problems, but um, it just makes me more productive. Or maybe not because I only got through like one fifth of what I wanted to try to do. So. While I wait for Duncan to come home, I'm gonna keep at it. And hopefully try to figure out why this dock is not working for me. All right, bud, you gonna fix it for me? He's like, no, but I would love you to scratch my face. I'll check him later. So Duncan, so Duncan got home. And brought Gadget upstairs with him and I was in my office doing some work. And all of a sudden, I was like, where's Gadget? And I found her on the bed, ready for bed. Right, right Gadget, right? She's like, no pictures, please. Ignore the fact that <laughs> our sheet is all sorts of messed up. We have another dog that likes to roll around on the bed and make that worse. Hi, Gadget. It's sleepy time. I don't know what you guys did today. You guys? Like you guys. Oh, like me and the vlog? Yeah. Well, we worked. And we Lula Road. And Oso was a business cat. And the dogs begged for dinner really, really early. And I, uh, yeah, that's about it. Welcome to our everyday life. <laughs> These are the things that happen every day. Oh, and they know about my computer. Which I fixed when I got home. Yeah. This guy. And I really didn't get any further than one-fifth of the way done. But it's all good. Tomorrow will probably be pretty boring as well. Maybe. But depending on when Duncan gets done with work, we might head to a resort. But we'll probably do, like, work there. Just, like, get out of the house a little bit. Oh. I'm tired. Mm -hmm. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Hey, Anna! Thanks for coming to the show! And for what? And for what? And for what?